Step one, wake up early, gon' rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, think real hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good. Set your affirmations, aspirations. I got shit to do. The aftermath of preparation. Good food, good mood, blood in circulation. One step at a time. Yeah, that's how you make it. Set a goal you control and the steps you take them. I try to pick one thought, have some concentration. And if I make a mistake, it's called education. I try to do this every day. Call it replication. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. 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 So life ain't easy, yo. I think there's a reason, though. Ups and downs, just like every different season, yo. Sometimes I'm high, other times I'm barely breathing, though. I always gotta fight and hide from the demons, yo. Negative thoughts are poison, they ride. Uh. Head full of flaws, so here come the clouds. Uh. They'll never stop unless I can swap all the bad for the good in my head when I'm lost. Uh. Yeah, so I'ma fake it till I make it. Positive thoughts are overtaking. I got patience, one day at a time. It's how you operate a cadence. So flow, you grow, you show yourself a foundation. Stay away from all the shit that causes temptation. I know that I like to do it 'cause it's a sensation. I live my life in my head like a narration. Don't expect greatness, do my best, man. I'll take it. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. 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 Today's gonna be a good day. All right, boys. So what is that? Let's get back to the boat and get ready for today's adventure. All right, boys. So the workout is done, and right now I'm heading back to the room. Uh, it was a great workout. Yesterday it took me almost two hours to find the gym. I'm living at H block, and the gym is at the K block. Believe me or not, it took me two hours yesterday. Uh, last night when I came over, uh, came back from exploring the Dubai. I came back to the hotel, and right after that, I went to like find the gym. But anyways, uh, workout is done. It was a great workout today. I did chest and triceps. Um, I only uh, went a little uh, light lighter because I'm on traveling I do not want to be sore while I'm traveling anyways having said that welcome back to the channel I hope you all are doing good uh, today is day 2 of our adventure and I'm all set actually I'm all not set uh, I have to get back to the room to get freshen up and then get ready and then we're going to start with our today's adventure so having said that let me find my way back to the my h block uh, because i am lost actually uh, by the way this apartments all these tall buildings that you are seeing this is actually um, a residence apartment and it is a huge place yesterday believe me or not i'm going to say be very honest i got lost uh, night it was night um, the time would be around uh, like 12 or 1 o'clock at the night but then again um, i could not read the signs at the night there was no uh, like street light or anything but anyways i finally made it back to the room and now i'm going to find my way again back to the hotel i'm again lost it go it's going to take me few days to get used to this huge place but anyways having said that let's get back to the hotel room get ready and then start with today's adventure i'll see you guys in a short while this is your captain speaking Alright boys, so we have started with our journey and we are in the cab now. Uh, to take a cab over here is very easy. You just need to get to the road and just uh, any, any cab that is passing by, you just need to wave your hand. If that cab is available, it will stop and 
there are no like bargaining or anything of that sort over here they are fixed rates so that is very sorted over here so our plan for today is we're going to visit dubai frame right now we are headed towards there only uh, according to google maps it's going to take us uh, approximately 15 uh, odd minutes um, cabs over all, all the cars over here run very fast uh, average speed is around 100 so yeah that is the scene there are two three things that we have planned to do today uh, first one is visiting the dubai frame and there are few other things as well we'll get to that once we cross that bridge so yeah let's continue with the drive and i see you guys at the uh, dubai frame so this is the dubai frame uh, we already have the bookings for this i know the gopro won't be able to show you this beauty but it looks massive so let's go inside and see explore what this place is all about so this is the center uh, part of the uh, dubai frame on the left side 
is I believe the old Dubai um, I'll just confirm this but looks like that this is old Dubai on the left side whereas if you go on the other side whereas on the other side it is the new Dubai and this whole place is made very uh, futuristic I would say the glass floor on which you are standing you can see directly underneath you and as you are walking on this uh, glass ceiling it looks surreal Alright boys, so that is all about Dubai frame. Uh, it was a beautiful experience. So let me just give you a small brief about what all experience we had inside there. So right when you enter into the Dubai frame, uh, the very starting of the phase, uh, it shows you how Dubai used to be in the olden times. Uh, it shows you how everything was handmade uh, back in the days, uh, how like everything was very basic like uh, it was it generally everywhere in the world uh, like we see in our villages and then we take the elevator to go towards the top and over there you saw like you could see right to the ground uh, it like uh, the small portion of the ground was like uh, transparent so you could see right uh, below you which is actually very um, I would say different uh, experience and the best part is the frame actually divides Dubai into two parts the left part and the right part one is the old Dubai uh, which is uh, on this side of, uh, uh, of the frame and the, on the right side is the new Dubai on which the Bur Burj Khalifa and everything is so then you explore that place and then you come take the elevator to come down and then it shows you how Dubai will be in the upcoming 50 years so how everything will be like automated uh, how robots will take place of humans everything how healthcare will uh, expand and how maybe we will reach to mars and that is all in uh, upcoming 50 years so that is the whole concept of this place uh, it's a very different experience and worth visiting if you are in dubai then i would highly recommend you to come visit this place and yeah that is all about this place now so now that we have explored this place the next part is going to be at the gold market because we have some shopping to do we are gonna buy some gold <laughs> so yeah that is all for the plan as of now uh, let's take a cab and hit the road and i'll see you guys on the road Never really noticed what you want With you I don't ever feel calm I can feel the sweat inside my palms Play with me like cats and a string You don't understand the pain it brings You don't ever wanna give me wings You don't ever wanna set me free You know I'm addicted to you And it's twisted you've been gifted with the evil voodoo Got me coming back for more even when I've been screwed Dolls full of pins, pierce my heart straight through Got issues in my head I like you in my bed But you keep me on red Oh, 
Everything is like a test I better not text or I'll come off desperate But if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead Baby, you'll get sick of being the monster Out of my head, under my bed Think you're something out of my Always sorry, the conclusion Even though I offer all of the solutions I wish you loved me like I love you, it's stupid When I'm alone with you, I never feel lucid I wish I wasn't struck by Cupid I wish when I first saw you, I knew this When I'm with you, I feel so useless I feel diluted, my heart's been wounded Silhouettes of you are like a time Never really noticed what you want with you, I don't ever feel calm I can feel the sweat inside my palm Play with me like cats and a string You don't understand the pain it brings You don't ever wanna give me wings You don't ever wanna set me free But if I lay down and I play dead and I stay dead Baby, you'll get sick of being the monster Out of my head, under my bed Think you're something out of my So as we started the journey towards the future museum, we were running a little late and it was Sunday so it was a rush hour at the museum. As it was a rush hour and there were a lot of people, I decided that I am gonna share my experience with narration so here we go. Our booking time was at around 3.30 but we did reach there at 5.30. At first we thought our tickets are all wasted but after convincing the staff, they gave us new tickets and we were in. As you start your tour, firstly they take you through an elevator which gives you a feeling as if you are in a spaceship and they imitate landing on Mars. space station which they have beautifully placed in the middle and they show some projections right underneath the model of how space station in, is revolving in space around the other planets. Right next to it is a table which shows you your whole solar system with sun being in the middle and other planets revolving it. As you move forward, there are different screens with different avatars where you can take your picture and your face will show on the character, giving you an impression of being in a spacesuit. Now as we move forward, we take an elevator to go to different levels. 
at second level. They show you how health sector will advance in future. There are different stations which have different themes as sense, touch, vibration, smell and so on. It was a beautiful experience and very relaxing. As we move forward from there to my favorite level which is technology. Here they showcase how technology will advance in future. Firstly this beautiful Audi. The right next to it was the feature of electric cycles. In the middle was a showstopper which was a working robot with which you can interact and ask questions and robot does answer all, all of my questions have a look will robots be able to uh, replace humans ai and robots are likely to radically transform jobs in the next decades instead of eliminating jobs humans will collaborate with robots and they will learn new skills like coding and cloud computing will robots get any smarter than humans most likely. Actually, you probably already live with many robotic systems, although you don't know they are robots. For example, robotic vacuum cleaners or smarter systems like Alexa are now very popular. Is there life in Mars? Some things should remain mysterious or the future will become boring. Were there aliens before we existed? Should remain mysterious or the future will become boring. Moving on, there were drones and other suits which incorporates different technologies. And there was a smart mirror which recognized your face and showed you your body parameters. For me, it shows high level of gas and aggression, which surprisingly latter was true. <laughs> and with this, we come to the final part, the rooftop. This is where you get to stand right in the middle of the structure and experience and admire the construction of future museum. I hope you enjoyed it.